In this video, I took a look at the top 5 craziest 3D Scratch games. Let's go. But I can't be doing it in normal Scratch. I'm going to have to do it in Turbo Warp, which essentially just runs Scratch projects but 4 times as fast. So as we can see, our first game is Victoid TD 3D version 1.4 by GGNG. Sorry, I'm terrible with usernames. And now it's loaded, so we can begin the open intro. It's already 3D. What the heck? Um, uh, where do I go in this? What is this? How many left? What? Oh wait, no, these are- wait, hold on, let me go back. This is Acid Sewer. Go in here. Okay, these are all just different. Okay, reverse mode. No. Oh, what the heck even is this game? Okay, I'm gonna go into easy real quick. Is this a balloon tower defense game? What the hell is this? Tips? Oh, best early game tower. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boring. Can I- Oh, it's a tower defense game. Of course. Can I place him? Oh my- This is made in scratch? No, it's not. This is not made in scratch. Okay, can I start? <laughs> This is not real. This is literally a full-on game. You can't make this in Scratch. Oh, I can upgrade him. Wait, what? Increase fire rate? You can- Oh my god, this is the great- I'm just gonna continue to upgrade him. Okay, uh, start the round again. Oh my gosh. This is like the craziest game I have actually ever seen in my life. It might be better than the mass. If any of y'all see my other video, you'll know what I mean. Go check it out after this one. I'm gonna increase the damage. I'm gonna start, and I'm gonna wait, because I'm gonna put down a couple lasers and electro, dark matter. All these things are so crazy. No, are we gonna make it? New enemy? Okay, uh, boom. Dude, how does somebody- make those okay wait oh i don't have enough okay i'm gonna need to start then i'm just gonna wait for little bro to you know finish it's like balloon tower defense but like almost better in a way oh no i'm not gonna make it all right oh no please come on please please let's go baby oh, i can put another one if i put it here i start the game again all right i'm gonna speed this up real quick and i'll let you see what the final result looks like Boss Vectoids? Something. Okay, whatever. I don't like reading. This is super cool, but I want to try one thing. I'm going to go to here, and I'm going to do Dream Road, and I'm going to do Sandbox. I really want to see what all these guns do. We have this. I want to see what this big one does. Where can I place it? Oh, I can only... oh it's like a boat in a way, because... Oh, okay. I'm going to upgrade it all the way, and you know, just... Yeah, okay, that's good. Put this guy maybe here. Upgrade him a little bit. You know, maybe put this little dude. He looks magical for some reason. I'm going to start at wave 100. Start. What does this guy do? Oh, it's like the ring thing. What does he do? Okay, maybe this guy kind of sucks. This is like one of the craziest games I've ever seen. There's so many levels and so many options. Like, oh my gosh. Please go check this out after this video. Psycho Game is Factory Building 3D by Awesome Llama. We've seen a lot of his games. I'm really excited. Wait, what? Oh my god, it's another 3D game. Well, of course it is, but first person textures and everything. What? Oh my god, this- oh my god. Where am I going? This is like a horror game. <laughs> Yo, let me in. Oh, wait, there's another way. I'm stupid. I've always wanted to make a horror game, but like, how in the heck? Let's go to B2. Oh, there's another door i want to open it can't cut okay let's see where else there is six two oh i feel like i'm gonna get jump scared for some reason oh, okay perfect this way red means good right they have steps in this game <gasps> i don't know why i find that so interesting but i love it yo can i go in the god gush darn door please oh my god look at the lighting as well and how some parts are dimmer than others that's crazy can i go in red that means i should do something bruh right, i will just go this way whatever oh open the door it's like a giant garage door thingy what about here okay looks looks like we have to turn back okay there's nothing over there i don't know why i looked at that this is where we began right Right. Oh, <gasps> this is crazy. They have an outdoor environment. Oh my god, I can't do anything, but it looks amazing. This guy should teach me something. Oh, can I open up? Let me in. Okay, I think I'm stupid. This isn't actually a game. It's just a showcase of like a 3D environment. Quite literally in the name factory building. So, uh, <laughs> this is still astonishing, but next game. For number three, we have Portal 3D Test Chamber something. Probably just with a version 1. Point whatever. Like Cooper 100. Chopper 100. I'm actually stupid. I should get better grade. Oh, well, let's go. Test Chamber 13. I ain't reading all that. Okay, look. Oh my god what the heck oh i can move like this perfect uh what's happening here oh yeah it's a 3d game if i walk through it oh my god dude this is cool as hell what did r do r to reset okay what if i okay i dropped on here then what oh my what dude that animation looks sick hold on what do i have to do uh how do i q e okay then what if i walk in here Okay, I'm in the other room that's floating. It was definitely buggy, but you know, it's still- Somebody made something 3D and especially portal, like teleporting everywhere. What if I want to go up there and then I can put a portal right here? Okay, that didn't do anything. I'm dumb. Oh, what the? Oh, there's a ball. What? Can I get it? Oh, what the heck? It interacts with- Oh, oh my god. I'm- Okay, okay. I have to get up here. Boom. That's so funny. That's crazy how they do that. And then what if I go like this? Okay, I don't know where to go, dude. Right here? Okay, I don't know how to do this game, to be honest with you. Oh, wait, what? Here? Boom. That didn't do anything. God damn it. If I just, like, go like that, and I go like this. Oh, wait, what? This is outside of the map. Yo, lit. This game is definitely sick, but extremely buggy. Next game. Our fourth game is Crystal Seeker 3D Platformer. I did... did 
the Jijen Jijen GAI. Yeah, I said that right. And let's go. God, I'm sure I click fast. Oh my gosh. Dude, this is like high detail. Click to proceed. Yeah, they're bad. Okay, we have to find all those dudes. The heck? Dude, all these. Oh my. What? Can I get on top of this tree? Oh my. Oh my gosh. Dude, an actual 3D platformer? I remember seeing one last time, but nothing like this. This one has like full on detail. Oh my gosh. Wait, jump on top of the. Okay, it's like Mario. Bang. <laughs> I don't know why I find that so funny. Get on top of the tree. If I can get on top of the tree. Thank you. Thank you. All right, let's go. Okay, I got 15 out of 56. Let's go. Dude, how is this dude they're all rotating oh my gosh i mean like the background and everything hello oh wait do those guys move i can't tell hey okay, whatever sign work to pause oh my god okay cool um can i wait wait how am i gonna die oh oh my gosh dude this is sick can i like look around oh my god <gasps> look around with the arrow keys oh how? What? Excuse me? What the heck? How do people draw these? Not even draw these. I don't, I don't know how this works, man. Hold jump to jump higher. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, perfect. <laughs> you died. Dude, I didn't know I could turn it. This is like on another level. What's this? Will respawn here if you fall? Okay, sick. Probably gonna need that to be honest. Oh, okay. Look at how smooth like the moving platform is. It like eases in and out. I'm, I'm gonna say I'm a little bit disappointed in the enemies though. They're just, they're not even 3D. They're just a bit of a 2D guy. Oh, okay. I want to get every single one of these coins. And I I love it how I can actually like see the bottom with the shadow. That just makes everything so much easier. Use to reach higher places. Do they bounce me? <laughs> they do. How did I? Oh my. Okay, let's see what dying does. Oh, it has even like a little bit of a cinematopic, cinematopic, cinematic death. Like a Mario game. This is like a Mario. Oh, what the? Oh, okay. I'm just gonna. Oh, okay. Perfect. Yeah, I, I knew that was gonna happen. All right, grab this one, this one, you. Oh, I almost died. Oh my god, look at how the shadow like gets bigger as you go up. Dude, that's crazy. Dude, the attention to detail here is just immaculate. I use fancy words. I'm cool, you know. Oh my god, okay. Here we go. Better get all the coins. Okay, perfect. And we just have to land on here. Easy peasy. Oh my god, I love it how I can look around. That's just the coolest thing ever. All right, let me get on the trees. You are done for buddy Ow. Well, actually, i actually like how they don't do damage they just knock you off different than the traditional way that's actually pretty cool however these trees are really buggy i'm not really enjoying them all right boom oh and we, we should have made it here right let's just look at the level like look you can literally oh my god dude this is so cool oh my god i can't get over that this is the goal okay okay a little fade dude it's like mario ish dude this is so cool i would definitely continue to play this but we need to get on to number five and our fifth game is ray traced minecraft 3d by 0261401 i showcased this game in my last top 10 video this needs to be number five because this is absolutely amazing pretty cool loading screen okay in the 2010 intro and i just uh, i'm not gonna get over this new world random seed let's go look at this just t just take it in it's literally making ray trace to minecraft look at the shaders okay look this is a perfect example how do i go down shift look at this patch of water here i'll let it render bro you can literally see the ripples in the water and you can literally see the warped reflection of the trees a warped reflection of the trees above here like if i look up obviously you can see trees trees here but they're casting a reflection onto the water which is phenomenal let's go explore some things what if i just want to take a little bit of a landscape photo well here you go it lit it's literally better than minecraft shaders but this is made in scratch like jesus and another cool thing you can do i think it's if i press e yeah we can build oh my god and we have options i didn't know this jesus okay but anyway let's say i just wanted to create a house or something oh god this is not gonna be fun how do i break something do i have to do this okay i do this is gonna be a big pain to make but you know all right let's just click this here maybe make a couple of these Oh my god, get rid of the grass. Just take a look at what I created here inside of scratch And as you can see the torch has a reflection right here And you can see that these cast a glow onto the object Which is the most crazy thing that I can't wrap my head around and this is running pretty smooth even on to turbo war Like I have how does I oh my god I have so many questions on how someone can create something like this who is smart enough to create this who is so dedicated Can I look in the Sun is there a Sun anywhere? Oh, that is the Sun. Wow. What if I just go up extremely high and I look down what that do maybe like a bit of a landscape shot and we'll just let it render look oh my god this literally looks like real minecraft how do i get rid of this how do i want to eat what the heck how do i there we go. If you showed me Minecraft in this picture, I would think that they're the same thing. And you can even see my little build at the bottom right. Dude, I'm surprised that, like, that scratch in my computer doesn't just blow. This is definitely, I think, maybe the best 3D game that I have ever seen in this game. <laughs> it's scratch. Well, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more. And I'll catch you later. See ya.